score, and that's what it was. Every time they'd get a lead, you came yep. back. They'd get a lead, or you'd get a lead, they'd come back. What is it about this Milliken team that yeah. you know found themselves victorious today? You know, they're a very young team, but their defense was great. I yeah. mean, I thought they were just, they got after a lot of balls. Number five is just an amazing Ooh. player. Yeah. She's a load. She's a handful. She does everything well. She passes, yeah. she hits, she plays defense, she blocks. Uh, yeah, we didn't slow her down too much. She had 24 kills, so uh, she had eight of them in the first set. So, I mean, she's just a special player. Yeah. You know, and we didn't answer that call, unfortunately. But, um, yeah, I mean, I think they're pretty bonded, and they play hard for her. I mean, this is Debbie's last year, and, yeah. and uh, really respect her. She's done an amazing job there. Uh, we're going to miss her, but... Um, yeah, we, we kept fighting. You know, we kept fighting. I thought, you know, set, I think it was set three. We were up. Yeah. You know, we let them go on a run. A little bit of a questionable call there, but, you know, that's life. You yeah. know, that's how it goes if you give them that opportunity. Yeah. But, you know, I thought I thought we showed some good fight, but they did too. Yeah. So they just hung, and we get set three. It looks a little bit different, right? And then yeah. you're going, you're at least going to go five and have that opportunity. <laughs> yeah. So, you know, we're still learning how to grind it out. This is a tough week for us. We've got amazing competition this yeah. week. And we just have to keep getting mentally tougher. Yeah. Sometimes we shut down and you just can't do that. You know, you gotta just rise to the occasion. So, um, keep figuring out how to fight through that. And I thought, you know, we had some good performances tonight. Yeah. I think I think their serve was just a little better than ours tonight. They got on some runs and you can't yeah. let good teams do that. Yeah. You can't have a server stand back there for six, seven exactly. points. You know, exactly. you have to get out of those rotations. So. so talk to me through this weekend, non-conference play, yeah. the final non-conference run of the season. What are you going to try to work on or anything? Yeah, I mean, we're playing some amazing teams. Yeah. <laughs> Two ranked teams. So out of the frying pan <laughs> into the fire, right? Yeah, exactly. We're playing like a number seven ranked. Yeah. You know, so yeah. there's nowhere for us to run and hide. We're just going to have to be tough. Yeah. You know, and I, I put us through a tough schedule. and. You know, it is what it is. Yeah. You, know, you just got to toughen up. And, you know, we're two and two in the conference now. Certainly not out of it by any stretch. Sure. You know, we got to just fight our way through the rest of these, get into the tournament, and see what happens. All right. Well, Coach, good luck this appreciate weekend out of Peter. conference. We'll see you in a Always week. Always appreciate you. All right. For Coach Ulmer and Peter Ferreri, we want to thank all of our staff and producers here today. Tough one in Kenosha, but Milliken fired back with three in a row after losing set number one. For executive producer Mike Love, producer John Voinovich, and for the rest of the crew, Emmett. Ty, Jessica, and Yam. This program has been a presentation of Carthage College Copyright 2023. We thank you again for being here for Peter Ferrari and the Firebird Broadcasting Network, Milliken 3, Carthage 1. Have a good rest of your night, everybody.